subscribe to software testing mentor channel learn latest technologies in software testing test automation testing tools and much more welcome to another tutorial from rcvacademy.com in this tutorial we will learn how to set up your development environment and what all jars or dependencies are required to set up cucumber jvm for your java environment so this tutorial will be totally focusing on um, cucumber with java so i have uh, downloaded all the dependencies or all the jars that are required to set up Cucumber JVM in your Eclipse IDE. So if you see the folder, I have already downloaded the jars, jar files that are required to set up Cucumber in your Eclipse IDE. So these are the nine jar files that are required um, in order to set up uh, your Cucumber development environment. So at the moment, don't uh, stress too much about the details of each and every jar I'll cover that in future tutorials but uh, to get started with the setup of development environment make sure that you download all these jar files uh, Cobertura, Cucumber Core, Cucumber Java, JUnit, JVM Depths, Cucumber Reporting, Kirkin, JUnit and Mokito Hall. So once you have downloaded all these jars in the next tutorial we'll see how you can use these jars to set up Cucumber uh, development environment. Now, there are multiple ways to download these jar files. I have downloaded these jar files from Maven repository website. So in order to download the jar file, just open the browser. Um, I'll close that. Just open google.com and search for Maven repository. And open the website and search for the uh, jar file that you're looking so for example I'm looking for gherkin uh, I'll select gherkin and click on search and you'll see info.cux and gherkin is available so click on gherkin and download the version that is available there so 2.12.2 and that's the version that I have uh, downloaded similarly uh, go so Cucumber J unit search and download the J unit. Okay, so once you click on J unit, uh, it will give you the option to download. So click on 4.1.2 and download the jar file. So if you click on this jar link here, it will start, it will ask you to download. Uh, it will ask you the location where you need to download and put that jar file. So follow this exercise or um, download all these jar files from Maven repository. Search each one by one uh, and download the latest available versions uh, and keep it at in, in one folder so that it becomes easier to set up your um, Cucumber uh, JVM environment in Eclipse IDE. So that is pretty much all about downloading uh, the required jar files for Eclipse IDE. In next tutorial, we'll see how you can use these jars to set up the Cucumber development environment and start writing these scripts. Thank you.